Jaw in a day is a new procedure um, where we are rebuilding the jaw in what used to take uh, months, six months to a year, uh, and condensing that into a single day. For patients with a jawbone that's missing, either because of cancer, a non-cancerous tumor, or side effects of cancer treatment, when we think about um, how to care for these patients, first and foremost, making sure they're cured of their cancer is really the most important consideration. However, in addition to that, um, when delivering care for these patients, it's also critically important that we help them get the shape of their face back and ensure that they have a great quality of life. Reconstructive surgeons in our field have gotten really comfortable with doing um, their surgeries efficiently and highly effectively over the past 20 to 30 years. And as we've gotten better at doing these surgeries, we've learned that not only could we remove the cancer from the jawbone, take a bone from the leg, make it a transplant into a new jawbone, and put implants into that leg bone so that at the end of one surgery, these patients are fully rehabilitated. We use something called virtual surgical planning, which is basically computer-assisted software that allows us to visualize exactly what the patient's anatomy is, precisely define where the cuts and the mandible are gonna be, and then pre-create um, a plate that fits to the patient's native anatomy. And that's really important because for the surgery in particular, we're talking about a millimeter um, being the difference between a, sec a successful surgery and an unsuccessful surgery. There's a lot of teams that can reconstruct the jaw, but the patient will not be able to chew at the end. Um, and in my world, that's considered a failure. So from the planning process, which is the most important process, we make sure we put the reconstruction in such a way that you can rebuild their teeth and function into it. For cancer patients, because most patients are being radiated, the surgery is more complex. Not many teams are able to perform such a procedure for cancer patients. We have a really great head and neck team that is the true um, interdisciplinary and multidisciplinary team. You know, we work cohesively as well as we can trust each other. When we do these complex multi-team surgeries, everyone has a very specific job to help patients get the best outcome. So during these jaw in a day surgeries, we typically have three or four teams of surgeons. One surgical team will be the ones removing the cancer from the jawbone. We have a different team of reconstructive surgeons who take the transplant from the leg. We have an oral surgery team and a prosthodontics team that put in the dental implants and then make the patient the teeth. It's really a huge team of people, all with very specific expertise. When I was a resident 10 years ago, uh, the, we weren't even doing implants into fibulas, and now um, we've surpassed that. That's the standard of care in all of our surgeries that we do. And now to be able to move on to offering teeth in the same day is really a game changer. Head and neck cancer has an ability to rob patients of their humanity. So um, being able to offer that is really important to be able to get people back to being the fullest version of themselves. It is important to offer this to a patient because the patient can go into the surgery knowing that they will retain part of their identity and their function when they wake up from the surgery. As head and neck cancer surgeons and especially operating at NCI designated cancer centers, our goal is to not just put people back together, but to create the best version of themselves going forward.